name's James, uh, James Dennett. Uh, that didn't, I didn't intend that to sound like James Bond, but there you go, it's happening. <laughs> um, my name's James, I'm the marketing manager for a Times Top 50 independent school, uh, Battle Abbey School, which is on the south coast, based in the town of Battle. We run two or three marketing campaigns a year, which are designed to uh, coincide with um, customer, uh, spikes in customer interest so for the independent school market obviously when people return in September um, uh, and when they start thinking about their school choices in the state sector which should be in March they're our key advertising times and we've for a number of years now used positive media for um, our local placement advertising which is part of our a multi-channel campaign that we run regionally uh, biannually yeah, in September and March. We use uh, positive media to get into places like gyms and things in areas that are of interest where we can't cite local advertising placement. You know, we run through, I guess, three channels in that sector and they would be the placement advertising we do with positive media. We also run ad, uh, six sheet ad shells in bus stops and we do some traditional um, we call them lamps and cushions magazines, you know, a lifestyle magazine. So we advertise in a few lifestyle magazines, but that uh, avenue is dwindling, particularly the local press isn't what it was. We do advertise in kind of um, church style, you know, uh, parish magazines. I wanted us to have a definite brand feel in terms of our artwork. I wanted to have this aspirational kind of, Thing. And our artwork for our campaigns has tended to revolve around kids with rocket packs, kids flying boats, <laughs> kids yep. sitting on clouds. It's kind yep. of, and we've used the kids um, at the school as the models for the campaign with parental consent, obviously nowadays. But um, gone the days when they were effectively orphans owned by the school. Now we have to, you know, follow GDPR and all sorts of things like that. Um, yep. So we use the model, and we know that the parents share the pictures of their kids widely, particularly the poster sites that we have at Prairie Meadow Shopping Centre, uh, which is the big local shopping centre. Yeah. Um, that's been, we've, we've seen those come up on Instagram and they're being shared by parents whose kids oh, feed. Okay. Yeah. So that's nice as well. Positive Media came in, I think we tested the water with them with a few placements over maybe like a Christmas over I can't really remember. How many now. years ago now? <laughs> yeah, yeah I, it was so many years ago now. I mm. reckon it must be at least five years ago. Mm. I think I think when we started getting this look, brand and feel, and this aspirational part of that was having these big... I think that, you know, the artwork, and I flatter myself that the, the campaign artwork is good enough, but actually having them large scale in kind of shopping centres and bus stops and things um, is... Uh, I think it, it's good to give them that impact. We, we've, we've had this discussion many times, but I, I love seeing your artwork come in because it's a breath of fresh air to see someone that understands the con you know, concepts and how to compile posters and doesn't put too much in, but has headings and bullet points and calls to actions and all those yeah. kind of things and the, you know, fantastic photography, all the, all the ingredients that make a good poster. It's so refreshing to to see and like you say aspirational as well so that's that's very that's very kind you know like we're yeah we're, we're very pleased with how it works we've got something that helps uh in terms of the graphics um helps us out we put the basic idea together uh and shoot kind of a rough draft and then they colorize it and they kind of they're like photoshop whiz and things and, um and we've got a, a professional camera and we're getting to shoot the final artwork uh but the concept is always ours um and we want to keep hold of that. I, I think the tank might run dry one. I'm going to, might have to start watering <laughs> creatively. So tank's going to run dry. So, James, I really appreciate your time this morning. Thank you for giving us. Hey, no worries. I'm glad you're pleased with the advertising and the service. And what we do. Yeah, great working with you. So, thank you. Lovely. No, it's a good. It's a good. It's a good relationship. Uh, we provide you good stuff to put up, and you put it up in places where people see it. I can't see uh, anything wrong with that, and I've long may it continue. <laughs>